70 degrees in some spots, but otherwise generally cooler than we've been. Remember last week, some parts? And then the chances increase as we go into the evening hours, and that's when we get some of the heavier stuff. We'll play out the future cast, and we'll see when that stuff arrives and when we can expect it, how long we can expect it to last in about 10 minutes. And we continue our breaking weather alert coverage. Out in Oceanside, the March for Babies 5K is getting ready to start no matter what the weather is like today. Tenders reporter Matt Mendez is live at the Oceanside Pier. How is it out there, Matt? Yeah, well, it's clear and dry right now, and hopefully it stays that way for the March for Babies walk. Take a look behind me. They have the amphitheater set up and all ready to go for this walk. I want to show you a video from last year's March for Babies walk. 10 News is a sponsor of the event. It helps March of Dimes fund research to, fi to find the causes of premature birth and ways to prevent it. And it also helps support families with premature babies in the newborn intensive care. Now, registration for the walk begins at 7 a.m. The program starts at 7.30, and the three-mile walk kicks off at 8 a.m. Now, although the heaviest rain should happen later tonight, that, that's what's expected. Rob Santos says showers cannot be ruled out this morning. Reporting live from Oceanside, Matt Mendes, 10 News. Okay, thanks, Matt. Now, once we start to get the heavier stuff, uh, flooding is possible. And if you get hit with Andy, the city of San Diego wants to remind you, here is the number to call. Um, you know, only call 911 for life-threatening emergencies. You can report street damage by calling this number, 619-527-7500. From windshield wipers to tires, both are very important for staying safe on the road. 